Bikers from all over the world are headed to Sturgis this week. The 84th annual rally gets underway this weekend, but a lot of bikers are already there or on their way. There's nothing quite like the sound of a Harley, especially the week of Sturgis. Dan and Lisa Adkins are from Ohio. They went to Sturgis last year for the very first time and knew they would be back. The scenery, we like to ride. We don't go for the drinks and party and all that. We go for the, the countryside to ride. It's a beautiful riding out here. Lisa also enjoyed the beautiful Black Hills, but couldn't believe the amount of people. Oh, I was just amazed at how many bikes there actually are. <laughs> and I know it's not all of them in the United States, but it's pr pretty close. We've met people from Japan, Australia, Canada, Korea. Yep. There's people from all over the world. Jared Taffet is also from Ohio. This will be his first time in Sturgis. Um, I got to see pictures, so that obviously made me want to go alone just for the scenery and getting to see Mount Rushmore and Custer Park, and there's a list of things we want to do when we get there. For JNL Harley, the weeks leading up to Sturgis and the days after mean big business for the store. We do sell some bikes, but uh, the merchandise, clothing especially, is a huge rain gear, for instance, last year was massive because it was raining the first probably four days of the festivals. For a lot of bikers, whether they're riding to Sturgis or not, they'll tell you riding a motorcycle is a way of life, one your local anchorman even enjoys. The 84th Annual Sturgis Motorcycle Rally officially gets underway on Friday and then runs for the next 10 days.